Hello everyone, and welcome back to 4 Kilobyte Shorts Let's Play of Tokyo Jungle. We have a mating issue. We need to mate. We're dying of toxicity. <laughs> so we're going to do that. We're actually pretty old as it was. Hey, nice. And so this is, this is where we started before when we died. So that's a great place to start over again. Um, we just unlocked the chick, though. Yeah, which means we can become a chicken, which means we're one step closer to becoming a porcupine. And if you didn't notice, I really like porcupines. Because they're the only soft, cuddly animal you don't want to hug. <laughs> I mean, they look nice from a distance. You're like, hey, look, porcupine, go ahead, try to grab it. Use both hands. That, I think it's interesting. If something, like, attacks a porcupine. I mean, there are things out there that eat porcupine, but honestly, I wouldn't. Alright, so we have some more challenges, including we have to head to Shibuya Woods. It doesn't look like there's any food here now, and that's a bad sign, so we're going to try to get out of here as quickly as possible. Of course, our vision is limited due to rain. Heavy rain. Something here got eaten. Gotta be cautious. Alright, we should be able to go out. Is it this way we go out? Yeah, we should be able to head out this way, so we'll just head straight down the street. Gotta learn the map a little bit better. I got lost last time. I almost got eaten. <laughs> Might still get eaten this time. I don't know. We're out running our uh, our decoys. I mean, they're not even like when you're playing a pom pom. They they can attack and stuff, and so they are they are helpful. And um, even if you die, you get them as extra lives. But these guys are actually yeah. Well, you saw they they're they're decoys. They're like fall over, so that guy will eat you and leave me alone. That's not cool. Okay, is this the right one? No, that's what happened. We took the we went right to our, we took the left too early. So you have to keep going. Why are all the plants dead? Let's be all the toxic goo. Uh toxicity's increasing. This is bad. That's okay, we can do this. We have our jogging outfit. Makes us look like an armadillo. <laughs> Hello dears. Uh, well, yeah, I know I'm hungry, but if you take a look around, it's raining and there's no food anywhere. Unless there's food, but I'm just not seeing it. But I haven't seen any plants, as, like, in the middle of the street or even up on the walls. And I have been looking, mind you. Oh, wait. Drink water. Drink the water. There we go. That's helpful. Not a lot, but it's a little helpful. All right. Getting better. We've got the wind at our back and everything. Like a hurricane force wind at our back. Hello. Free gift. Because you're dying of stuff. I know I'm hungry. There's more water here. <laughs> there, better. At least we left the water pools on uh, jackals. Hyenas, not jackals. Jackals look more like wolves. Plant. Plant, 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 plant. Two plants, actually, I think. And we are hungry enough to risk the hyena problem. Yes! And we leveled up. Alright, we good? Alright, we are good. So, we can try to finish all the Class D challenges. Not sure how that's going to work for us. Visibility in decreased due to smog, really? Alright. Let's just, let's just get through here, I guess, because this place is toxic as all hell, just like before. Which means all the food's going to be toxic. And that's not good at all. All right, we want to go this way. Da, 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 da. We'll mark it. Crap, wolf. Uh, he shouldn't see us because he's got his head in the grass. Ha ha ha, bastard! He'll see us. Oh, those shits. Here, eat him. <laughs> I'm a bastard. Ah, uh, that was fun. Okay, so it works. It's terrible. I don't really like doing it, but it works. Yeah. Okay, this is not toxic, so we're going to drink it. That helped a teeny, tiny, tiny bit. Come on, we got to go to Shibuya Station. I know it's increasing. I don't... Well, I have the pet medicine. I do have that. Is there... Please tell me it's not toxic here in Shibuya Station. It's not toxic, but it's... No, it's toxic. Horse! A horse, a horse. Of course, of course. Pardon me? Whoa! That dog just took a chunk out of me. Here, eat him. Leave me alone. <laughs> I am so terrible. Now that it matters, we're going to die soon anyway. We're toxic all the hell. Is this water toxic? I think the water's toxic. It looks toxic. Well, uh, more gazelles. 
See, at least I'm trying to survive. We could have died so long ago, but instead I feel like trying to survive. Crap, why did the lion notice me? Go away, lion. I have only one brother left, and I'm saving him for an emergency. <laughs> That's terrible. Life decreasing due to critical toxicity. Yay, because I can't get out from under the toxic weather. We are in Doganzako. It is not toxic anymore. We are... Whoa, 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 why are the gazelles angry? What did I do? What did I do to the gazelles? I did nothing. Give, leave me alone. I did nothing to you. Go away. I have no idea what's going on here. Gazelles are apparently angry at deer. They don't like deer. Why don't you like deer? Here, have a hyena. Aw, man. I failed. I just got here, too. Why are you guys angry? Oh, he died of toxic shock. Okay. Yeah, leave me alone. <laughs> Why are the rabbits angry at me? What the hell did I do? I will end all of you. I swear to God I will. Ugh. Okay, so apparently it has something to do with toxic shock. Or something. I don't know. Maybe they're all crazy because of toxins. I have no idea. These are all toxic. I can't eat them. <laughs> eat a mushrooms. Change generations two times. All right. Well, I'll see what I can do. Because crazy gazelles. Maybe that hyena will eat that gazelle. Or not. Could have been more helpful. Ah, crap. Speaking of hyenas and pissed off gazelles. Why do they hate me? I'll eat while we're hiding in the grass. <laughs> Are we good? Rabbit? Okay, rabbit's not angry at me. I'm cool with that. Stay low. I have no idea what is currently happening. Let's see. Oh, Doganzaka is just loaded with food, isn't it? The animals in Doganzaka oh, have gone berserk. That's why. Okay, that's nice to know. What do we got? Oh, I never made it to Shibuya Woods. Damn it, I was one one station off. I thought that was Shibuya Woods. Okay, my bad on that one. Oopsie. Um, so challenge list, I guess we're up here now. Yeah, eat a mushrooms. Change generation two times. Find Shibuya Station parking lot. Parking lot. Shibuya Station parking lot. What the hell? Wait. Can I get to? Sh I can't. I have to actually go there. So, oh yeah, they've gone berserk, so now that rabbit's pissed at me. <laughs> That's always nice. I'll end you, rabbit. You leave off. So yeah, the berserk animals are actually trying to damage me because they're crazy. Can I mark this? Okay, I have to be standing in it to mark it. Alright, so not all animals are safe because sometimes they're nutsy. Good to know. We got more rabbit. A horse. Oh, great. Oh, and a zebra. Awesome. Zebras are awesome. All right, we have taken over Doganzaka Nest. Sweet. Now we need to get back to Shibuya Station. Uh, why? I don't know. Because there are horses, and horses are awesome. All right. Lion. Probably not the best idea to go this way, but we're going to anyway because we're nut job. No, you saw nothing. You saw nothing, you damn jackal. Yeah, I'm not going to win against the Jackal. <laughs> uh, oh, well. So that was fun. Whew, this game gets hard. I think the hardest part is the Toxin, because the Toxin makes you run. You can't, like, stand anywhere. But I guess if you were to to equate this with games like FTL, the Toxin is the equivalent of the Rebel Fleet coming at you, you know? But that's okay because we're feeling awesome, and the reason we're feeling awesome is because we unlocked the chick. So we are going to check it out. We're going to try to be a little chick. Tweet, tweet. That's right. Oh, but first I guess we should do a new story mode, right? Because we unlocked one. Always important. Ooh. Beagle! Down with the Tosas. You're sick of being walked all over like some sort of lapdog. You've broken away from the leash that has been holding you back, but... 
time to own. So we get to play a beagle. I thought we were going to play a deer, but no, we get to play a beagle. Awesome. So we're just mixing up the animal kingdom today. We got dinosaur, we got we got deer, we got pom-poms, chicks, rabbits, beagle. We're going to be beagle. <laughs> That's right, bitches, I come for you! Beagles don't command much respect among the other animals here in the city. Or anywhere. But they were once excellent hunting dogs, worthy of respect. Yeah, he does look kind of badass. They're now in the process of regaining their killer instinct, which humans had suppressed. By panting? I'm gonna breathe really hard until it comes back to me. Go, Snoopy, go! That's right, Snoopy was a beagle. <laughs> that rabbit just kicked your ass. Oh, no, he didn't. Okay. Hi, guys. Never a day passes not haunted by memories of the detestable Tosas who spoiled their hunt. Aww. Claim this territory and freedom for beagle kind from the Tosas. Okay. That was a long introduction, but it sounds like we just have to kick ass. First, find a female dog and create a pack. Oh, so we're going to do a war is what we're doing. We're warring up. Okay. Beagles are kind of slow. Beagle, why are you so slow? I thought beagles were fast dogs. Well, they're good hunting dogs, but mostly I think they just sniff stuff out. I don't think they actually eat the things they're hunting. Yeah. Did that chicken just like... Really? Did that chicken really just do that? <laughs> Fine, I have a rabbit. That was really lame. That chicken threw me off. Twice. Where'd you go? Where'd you go? I'm gonna kick your ass. Alright, that was helpful. So I'm hungry. I need to eat. Yeah, need to eat. Alright, and then we need to eat this. That way we won't die. Yes, I love not dying. It feels so good. Woohoo! Alright, so there's love above our heads. Come to me, my love. Can I double jump? I cannot. Oh, why can't I double jump? That would make me so awesome. How do I get up there, then? Um, let's take a look. Well, I don't think there... Well, there is a way up there, but I don't think I really want to find it right now, so we'll go around the other way. Yeah, you better run, rabbits. We'll see what's up over here. And what is up over here is... A doggy. It's a Silky Terrier. Bye-bye, Silky Terrier. I think that other one's underground. Really? Can we go underground? Oh, wow, okay. So it's underground underground. A female dog. She's such a bitch. <laughs> the prime female. You found your mate. Soon you'll have your army. Yeah, well, I guess you can make an army that way if you really felt like it. Expand your influence without alerting the Tosas. Ah, so this is teaching me how to use the sewer systems then. You should be able to travel unseen through the sewers. Hey, man, I just said that. Copycat. So you can live in the sewers. Take the female back to your lair. Like Batman? I'm Bat Dog. I have a lair. Actually, there is a way to do this, and you have to... Okay, so we have to go up to that one. I'm cool with that. So, yeah, I have this, like, lair, and it's totally awesome, and you should absolutely come with me. I think those are the Tosas there. I have this odd feeling that's what that's what's there is. Oh, no, angry cats. An army of pissed-off kitty cats! An army of pissed-off armored kitty cats! <laughs> No, leave me alone, cats. I need to get to my lair. Woohoo! Oh, well, that wasn't helpful. Is there no place to hide down here? Leave me alone, cats. Ah, we were hidden. Once they all get here, they should be confused enough to leave us alone. Shit. Oh, so the helmets help. Come on. Come on. I know I'm hungry. 
We'll eat right after this. Come here. Come here, you stupid cat. All right. That was a lucrative event. Yeah, for whatever reason, whenever I see that little thing that says you should kill them, I always try to. I don't know why. It's like all those little red teeth just like I'm all like Rah! and I just kind of rage out and I just want to kill everything. We're here now. Oh, the the yeah. You'll need to secure a safe place before you can mate. We will. We're down to twenty six five four. Okay, so it's it's only going down a little bit, but we killed all the cats. Unless they brought in reinforcements and they're on the surface still looking for us. Okay, now we will mate. Hopefully they use the correct sound this time. Oh, well, that's a little different. Okay. That's weird. But hey, at least it wasn't the, the howling deer. <laughs> Three months later, your army is ready. Wow, that is a lot of dogs. You have been busy, good sir. The time has come. The beagles will have their vengeance. Oh yes. It's time. <laughs> awesome. We just gave away our position! <laughs> and the Toasters are out there going, They're building an army, sir. Then the time has come. Stage is set. Head for the Toasters' lair. How many of you are coming with me? All of you? Are all of you coming with me? Not all of you, okay, so a few of you are coming with me. So I guess the maximum number of little puppy dogs you can have is like six, five or six. Looks like six, but they keep moving around. One, two, three. Oh, they're in a line now, yeah, okay, six. <laughs> so you can have six little, six little army lits at, with you at the same time. All right, so head for the Tosa's lair, which is this way. Which means we have to go, can we go up from here? We can't go up from here, how do we get there? How do we get there? Oh, okay, I know how. We get there by going up onto the rooftops. Use your sense of smell. That's what I was just doing. It's called sh uh, it's like checking the map, yo. <laughs> Although it is cool that they call it use your sense of smell versus checking the map. Hip. Nom me some chicken. Wait, was that chicken like angry at me? Is that what was going on? Pig. Run away, little piggy. Me and my army of doglets are coming. That's right, cat. I killed all your friends, and then I ate them, and they fueled the fires that made my doglets. Bah! I am Beagle. Hear me bark really annoyingly until someone hits me with a newspaper. I don't know why I did that. I was just up there. Come on. There you go. Run away, rabbit. We are coming. Actually, an army of beagles would not be a bad idea. You know, just for fun, mostly. What do we got? What does that say? Poof? Pull? Pull? P-O-O-E-L? Pull? The Tosa aren't, isn't here. It can't be far. Go and find it. Oh, it's an H. So we're hunting the Tosa. Nice roof garden. Do, 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 do. The music's a little bit repetitive, unfortunately. Not like dubstep repetitive, but like, well, not that that's a bad thing. I mean, not good dubstep repetitive, just repetitive. All right, the Tosa are here. This is our moment. There's three of you, and there's like a lot more of us. Except we're all half your size, including the biggest one we got. Like a boss. <laughs> it's the Tosa, work with your allies to take it down. This is where we, like, order our team to kill things. Yeah! Oh, I missed. Ow! Take down! Go, 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 go! Eat him! Eat him! Beat him to within a sense of his life, or an inch of his life. Yeah, two down. Nope. Go, my army. Go, attack. Now I will nom you. Let me nom him. I need to nom him. It only works if I'm allowed to eat his heart. 
Oh, okay. The toaster is hurting. Now's your chance. Oh, look how smug he looks. Okay, at this moment, we need to focus on the giant fish. <laughs> That's how the scene ends. We focus on the giant fish. Alright, so cool. We got to play a beagle, and they taught us about the sewers that we didn't know about. So now we have sewers. I'm not sure how helpful the sewers are, but they're there, and we can use them now. Maybe there's alligators down there. Ooh, alligators in the sewer. All right, super awesome. So, next is more survival. And to do more survival, we need to grab... Doo -doo -doo -doo, new chick! This one's going to be so hard. It only takes 6,000. Are we good? There it goes. Okay, so, <laughs> so look at the chick stats. Compared to, like, the deer... And the Pomeranian, the chick has like nothing. He's got stamina and hunger, so he doesn't need to eat much, and he can run really, really fast. Yeah, you guys are gonna giggle, because this is gonna be funny! I'm not sure if that's been time or not, I'm not sure how long that story mode was, but we'll go ahead and start with the chick and see how that goes. Alright, so here we are. We have oh wow, this is as fast as I can go? <laughs> the but I can fly. I fly. I don't just run, I fly. I have no idea how this can end well. And the chick has like story mode challenge stuff that he can do. How is that even possible? I look kind of like a fly, like a fly fly, not like I'm flying. Buzz, 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 buzz. Buzz, 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 buzz. Yeah, you have to do a lot of hiding as a chick, I swear. <laughs> Oh, we can double jump too. That's kind of cool. Uh-oh. There is a dog up there. We're just going to peck at it. Peck, 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 peck. Doot, 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 doot. Hi, chicken. I'm one of you, but smaller. Oh. Okay, so we have to eat grass, intake 2,000 2, calories, and head for Doga Doganzaka Station. So I guess we'll do that first. But in order to do that, we need to... Well, I guess we should just head the other way, because we don't really need to mark any of this stuff right now, do we? So that's just me being fruitlessly stupid. <laughs> I'm pretty sure this guy moves as fast as every other animal, but of course, because he's so tiny, and because he's just floating on his little tiny, you know, wings, it doesn't feel like he moves that quickly. We might just run into a dog here in a second. Yeah, we're dead. Ah, run away! <laughs> Yeah, that didn't end well, and that did not last long. So unfortunately, I got used to them spawning us without much danger, and we got spawned in with a terrier. <sighs> Super fun. Okay, um, we'll go ahead and check our really crappy score. Wow, our animal rate is times two. That means we get a lot of points if we survive with this little guy. So, um... For now, I think I think that's been time. I'm going to go ahead and guess and say that it has been time because that little story mode did take a little while. But we are going to play the chick again, absolutely. We, we, we really, 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 I really, really want to get the rabbit. And then from the rabbit, I really, really, really want to go get that porcupine. Awesome. Um, and so for that, we're going to go ahead and pause here. So once again, I would like to thank you all for joining me for Kilobyte Short on this Let's Play of Tokyo Jungle. And uh, I will see you next video.